very random. It's Hit the Road Jack by um, by Ray Charles because okay. it is my son's favorite song. Okay. So thank God he doesn't like things like Barney and all that nonsense. He <laughs> loves the classics. So Ray Charles, Hit the Road Jack, he, he wants me to play that song over and over and over again for him. Oh woman, oh woman, don't treat me so mean. You're the meanest old woman that I've ever seen. I guess if you say so, I'll have to pack my things and go. That's right, hit the road, Jack. And don't you come back no more, no more, no more. I literally embarrass myself almost on a daily basis. Um, I think with two specific situations. Number one, as a mom. To a small child, I mean, I'm talking about Leo and not the babies, but you, well, actually, you're my babies. You're constantly doing silly things, things like pulling silly faces, speaking in a weird voice, um, dancing like a maniac with your child. So, I mean, if anyone had to watch that from like a fly on the wall perspective, that would be pretty embarrassing for me. And secondly, I am pathetic with names and faces, but I mean, to the point where it's, it's something I really wish I could change about myself. I don't remember anybody and it's not because I'm trying to be rude it's just because I have a brain like a sieve I don't know what happens to all that information but I mean so I'll have someone like coming up to me and say hi Vanessa how are you doing and I have no idea who they are and that happens to me a lot so I'm like always pretending yes hi how's it going and thinking oh my god please try and remember who this is <laughs> so that's really embarrassing and it's, it's something that's getting worse because it's something called mommy brain mm -hmm. so the more kids you have you get so that's what I'm blaming it on. <laughs> I tell my kids and my husband and my mom and my dad and my sister that I love them every single day so the last time I told them was before I came to this interview <sighs> that would probably be my wedding night which was about six and a half years ago no, no, I'm like, no, my husband and I went, sorry, no, Leo was about two when my husband and I went away together for the first time, and we went to, to the south of France with some friends, and that was the last time, so not too bad, that was probably about two years ago. Every single day, every single day I do that, um, especially with, with my eldest, with Leo, he just does things every day that astound me, and, and just so funny. Um, give you an example yesterday driving in the car mm -hmm. and um, his cousin Kian who is his favorite person in the whole world goes to a little place called, called Smiley Kids mm -hmm. so Leo was sitting in the back seat and he asked me he said mama where's Kian and I said well Kian's at his play school mom and he's at his school Smiley Kids and he said Kian's school is Smiley Kids and I said yes and he thought for a second and goes is my school angry kids and I just thought it was the funniest thing coming out of this little mouth and um, yeah, so he makes me laugh all the time. Really. What you said? Don't you come back no more. I didn't understand. Don't you 